Hey guys, it's me, Emo Simmer, and welcome back to part nine of Let's Play The Sims Three Generations Seasons Four. So in this part, we're going to continue where we left off last time. Last time, um. Sandra moved out. We're just gonna have to pretend that she got married and if she got pregnant, we're gonna have to pretend that she got pregnant as well. As I didn't really want to waste time getting her married and pregnant again on this one. But also off camera when I was trying to get things back to normal. Which probably would have happened even if they were on the laptop one. But what happened was a uh, dove and James got A's so they got to age up so they're now teenagers and Jake and Caitlin got to become adults now since Dove and James are now teenagers there be elders when Dove and James get to young adults. I think that's how I normally do it and that's how I want to do it this time. So yeah. I think everyone's going to be asleep soon. We're just waiting for the cats to finish what they need to do. Then everyone will basically be asleep. Jake wants to move into a new house but he's not going to do that. The bad thing about this is I'm going to be late to bed again because I have to mess around doing this. And I could have done this by now if I didn't have to get it back to normal. I don't know why they can't just stay the same on both. It would be a lot easier if it did. Five days until his midlife crisis is over. I'm pretty sure she aged up into an adult as well, but she's not got a midlife crisis. I don't know why. I thought she was supposed to have one as well. They should be awake soon. Six AM apparently. But hurry up then so we can get this part started and something interesting will hopefully happen. I'm gonna break up with the TV if he can ignore me. But there was a cat that woke up. One of the bowls needs to be filled. Sandra's old room is now the cat room. You can have some new food out of your bowl. When you're awake, you can scratch. When you're awake, you need to groom yourself. That's what it is. What? And you can. Use the toilet and unclog it if you have time to unclog it. Best to leave that to someone else if you don't think you've got time. So you can wake up now. Clean up. And have some waffles. You might have to make some more if we run out. You can shower, use the toilet, clean it. 
And then afterwards, maybe need some waffles. In case there's no waffles, I'll tell you to get cereal. Okay. Now wake up and use the toilet. And also have some cereal in case there's no waffles left. There are waffles left. Have waffles in. The person that can repair the toilet or unclog it is Caitlin. She can do it. If you're clean now, then you need to get a picture of you for the thumbnail. I'm gonna go with Doug this time. Couldn't find any other hair that suited her than her childhood one. So it looks like she's stuck with that because I can't find any other ones that suit her. I don't want to download too much custom content. You've got time for food, I'm afraid. So it's a good thing we cheated that because you haven't got time for food. There we go, that's what I want to do. Hopefully that's a good enough picture. You must hurry up and eat because you've got school soon. Unless you go a day off then no, you have got school. So hurry up. Stir crazy. Well, maybe you could hang out with some friends today. Or go out by yourself. You are friends with our oh, high school friend. Uh, or babysitter or something. Ebenezer, I think this is. Ebenezer Scrooge, if only it was. <laughs> Who's that? Robin Beckman. And. Barry Whitfield is from high school. Are you friends with so many high school kids or, or children? You're friends with some supernaturals it seems. Nothing wrong with that. I'm guessing they're all parents and stuff. That's why you're friends with all them. You could go out with uh, some friends. Allow me to just... Uh, you need to fill the bowl first. You've got enough friends, then let's plan this day out. We also need to pay attention to the cats. Okay. Maybe just with the girls. Elise Emerald at school I think January <laughs> Don't know if that's a high school student And Don't know if they are good They're like say they busy or something Or maybe they have work If they're an adult the bars are going to glitch out and they're best to go somewhere else. Somewhere nice. Maybe the subway. Pretty sure it'll have a coffee machine there where you order coffee and brownies. It's like a cafe in the subway here. I think it's basically in real life anyway, but yeah. Everyone will be there. Let's check on the cats. Cameron, you can use that tray. Eat. And we have another one to fill up when we're going out. Selfish. You can use the other tray, which is in here. And scratch. And also, 
play with that toy, Corbin, and just scratch. And yeah, I'm sorry if it's not winter on my laptop one. I honestly can't remember, but all I know as of right now that it's winter on this version. So, yeah, that's basically um, how it is. Sorry I got hung up on something, maybe we can meet up again soon. Hopefully someone's going to be there with her because she's so crazy so she needs to get out of the house. I'd rather her do that with friends than on her own. Because there might not be any nice people that she can meet at the cafe alone. She could just read her book in the library to so crazy, but it'd be nice for her to see her friends. I haven't even seen her in this car yet. Have to figure out how we can order as a group. So I don't want them to order separately. And then to stay together. Food register. Drink, try. But there could be like, is this a self service one or can you not ask her for some? Probably, you probably have to make it yourself. So we we'll just keep serving hot beverages till there's enough for everyone. If we have to do it ourselves, because I thought that we could just do it. Not do it ourselves, but like us someone at the counter to put it for us. I think they want to go to the, a movie or something. Where's the movie theatre or cinema? Where is it? Because we might be able to go there. It's normally films here too. First day at 12. So today at 12. But we'll wait till 12. And the one at the theatre is 5. We could go and see the one at 12. If I remember. Let's hurry up and drink then. Unless they mean Thursday on week three. Got to rage them up on the laptop one. I don't think Dub's even born on the laptop one. So we still got to give birth to her on that one. So we're well behind on that one. I don't know why I like to rate them automatically. I just randomise the genetics. I could have really done that. So it's too late now. Oh, Cassandra's here. Did we invite her? I can't remember inviting her. But it's still nice to see her. I could have really invited her out if we didn't. Maybe it will let us add her to the group. Is there a way we can do that? Greet. Forget drinking that. 
and just go and talk to your daughter. Because it, it's nice to see her. Don't walk away from us. So a way we can ask to go to join the group because she might want to hang out with us unless the group's been disbanded. I don't think it has. So yeah, there it is. I'm stupid. How did I not see it there? Oh yeah, it's twelve. The movie's on now. Probably too late to see it. So we'll probably have to catch the one at five. What? I thought it said the movie was on at Thursday at twelve. Must have ended or something. So I'm pretty sure that's what it said. Ten game group. Three days at three pm. Oh the concert's normally there, so if we ever have one. In show time, then you know what we're doing. Is there anything we can do together? What about this? Is there anything we can do as a group? If the library's anywhere around here, then my suggestion is go in there. At least she can read her book then. Get better at cooking as well. I'm thinking of leaving soon, and so is the other one. Don't even know the names. I know who's getting in the front. Is that Cassandra? No. I think we're waiting for the other two though. They better hurry up. We have to get back soon for the cats. Bookish. You've got a book in your inventory, so read it. Okay. Let's check on the cats now. Whoa. You need to eat, Cohen? Corbin or whatever? You need to use your tray. And that's pretty much all you need to do. And Nona, you need to scratch and maybe sleep as well you don't need to scratch stop lying to me you don't really need to sleep so what did you lie for you can scratch though Cameron at least you don't lie to me do need to go back home soon to fill up the bowls though. That's all I'm gonna say. Our daughter's probably bored of this. She's like not interested in books. Well, Sandra actually got a book. Congratulations! Let's just start a new clip. In case I don't get to read it all in one one go, I don't want to forget where I was. And 
plus this clip is nearly over. So let's read it now. Well, as I said, congratulations, Jake's impressive performance has earned a promotion to middle school teacher as well as a bonus of 490 civilians. As a middle school teacher, you have to balance your lesson plans carefully with, with so many topics to teach biology, geography and music. Oh my, the other teachers also elected you to be the new chess team coach. Checkmate. Jake now makes 42 civilians per hour and works from 8am to 3pm. Probably be a high school teacher soon, hopefully before he's a elder. Have him retire when he's an elder. That's what I normally do. I'm not going to change my ways. What do you want to do? Change jobs. Too bad. You're not going to do that. And when when you're home you can have something to eat. Maybe fill up the bowl first for the cats. Caitlin can probably come home soon. She might be out till five, like or whatever time the movie finishes. She gets to see the five one. She missed the twelve one. No, we were a few minutes late, but they could have still let us in. Okay, fill the bowl and then have some spaghetti, oh wait, some mac and cheese, and then sleep. Is there anything else you need? Your charisma and logic is apparently not that good. Looks like you ain't going to sleep till you practice speech and not having a shower either. And you also need to practice your logic. So practice chess. Also that uh thing needs to be cleaned, that tray. So that's another thing that they have to do. What are you following him for? And you could be asleep in here. With Nona. Look how it's supposed to be. If they all decide to leave you then you're not watching that movie alone. You can just go home if they all decide to leave you. They shouldn't be bored of you. Be scolded? What for? You went to school? I don't really understand why you're being scolded for. Is this a glitch or something? You're in big trouble, young lady. You better not do that again. Maybe you should help around the house to get on the good side. And I think he's going to shout it. James as well, but they didn't even do anything. What are you shouting at me for? Okay, you can have some mac and cheese, but you're not sleeping or doing anything else till you've done your homework. How about you stop wasting your time on them and deal with what you need to deal with? It's now you've got to wait for Dub to get her food before you can get yours. you can't wait any longer, just get on with your homework. And what else I told you to do was practice speech and practice logic. So that's what you're going to do. I thought you already got it up, but now you've got a motion you probably need to keep practicing.
And his phone is ringing because that's annoying. Ignore it. That bin must need emptying because we can't put it away in the bin for some reason. She's gonna tell them off when she gets home, but what have they done? They went to school, so I don't understand why they're getting told off from skipping school. They went to school today. That's why they got homework. Someone's clearly an idiot. Must be a glitch or something. It's rather annoying. Okay, looks like you're gonna have to continue that some other time because now it's five. If the movie's still not on, if the movie's not on any longer, then we can watch the sim fest. But it is, so ten movie with group, circus road trip, I think, will be the best one for them. They are adults, so they can basically see anything they want, but. That's the one I picked. That's the one they're seeing. I think um, Cassandra's probably insane because she's not wearing her outerwear or anything or her everyday clothes. She's just wearing a dress, which I think I set as her formal. So she must be insane not to wear the right thing. If you guys don't hurry up and get in the Oh, then you're gonna miss the movie, so hurry up. We're just waiting for someone else to get in the back of the car and then we can go. Is that someone they know? No, but it is a celebrity. So I guess they could probably do know him from somewhere if he's a celebrity on this game. But you better hurry up and get in there before you lose out. After you and James have done your homework, that's when you can sleep. Till then, you better sort out your other stuff. Like doing your homework is what you need to do first. That's what I'm trying to say. You need to complicate it. After the movie, you can probably disband the group and then clean the tray. That's really dirty. Who's that? Is that Cameron laying down there? No, but Cameron does need to do something. I don't know if there's any room for him to get to his tray from there. We'll have to give it a try. And then after that, you can eat from bowl. And after that, he can uh, play with his toy, Nona. Don't know if you want to use that as it's dirty, so I'll just boost that up for you. Then you can scratch. Then groom yourself. And then Corwin. You can scratch. Another thing you can do is play with a toy maybe it should be over soon so if it is it's getting pretty late for them
probably just found the group finish watching after they finished watching the movie I should have said before I was cut off rudely Some films strike the perfect balance of great dialogue, engaging characters and gra gripping plots. Caitlin is in cinematic ecstasy. Can we disband the group? Well, let's normally disband group, not ask to leave group. We gotta ask them individually if we can leave, or just one person, and then we can go home. You should know how to have time. Hold me any time for fun or whatever you've broken up. I can't believe we have to ask them individually. Oh, wow, Sandra has the same coat on as us. Just ask them to leave the group, it's been just endless. I really enjoyed myself, we should hang out again in the future. And I think lastly is our daughter. You should know how to have a good time, Put me any time for fun or whatever you've opened up. What a great time, everyone was pleased with the outing and will be excited to go out again. Glad to hear it. Who are you waiting for? They've all gone home. There's really something wrong with you. They've all gone home. If I have to teleport you, then you're really stupid. To think that they, they're they coming home with you and they've went home. You've ended the outing. Right. Let's teleport you here. Or have we got to reset you? We might have to reset you. Reset sim. Reset sim. Caitlin. Cannon. Okay, now let's teleport you here. Then you can clean the tray and sleep. Okay, if that's good now, then work on your logic ok the cats Cameron you need to scratch and also sleep no, no, you don't need anything, I don't think. Not from what I can see, at least. Play with the toy, probably, is what you need now. And also, for when you can use the tray. So stop playing with that. Use your tray and... Anyone else eating? Didn't I tell you to play with that? So what's wrong with it? Go and play with it now. And call and you can eat from bowl. Keep an eye on the time, it's nearly 12 a.m. for them. And that's when I end the part, so yeah.
Okay guys, I'm going to end this part here. In the next part, we'll have to work towards getting Dove and James A's. Then they can age up and move out. I think they're both on C's at the moment. But maybe they will improve their grades over the next few parts. Probably part 10 or 11. They move out. Depends when they get their skills. So yeah. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment. Follow me on all my social media sites. Bookmark it. And I'll speak to you guys in my next video. Which will hopefully be on Thursday. Of the Sims 3 seasons. So yeah. Thanks for watching. Bye guys. Thank mm -hmm. you.